Welcome to the Ho Chi Minh City University of Education. Today, we will visit the Department of Primary Education and some places where you can meet our students. The Department of Primary Education is located on the third floor of Block A. It is the Department of Primary Education Staff Office. And this is a working place of lecturers on our department. If you have any questions or need any information, but you don't know where to find support, don't be hesitant to come here, because our teachers will surely welcome you with a big and friendly smile. The main office is also the shared space of our staff. The room is not too large, but contains all necessary equipment for daily tasks such as bulletin boards, weekly calendars, desks and chairs, folders and filing cabinets, computers, printers, scanners and photocopiers, air conditioners, clocks, and water purifiers. To track information related to training activities, students can follow the websites, fan pages of the university and department or come to the office during office hours. Based on the regulations in student handbooks or advisor handbooks, supporting staff help students with scholarships and administrative procedures. Academic transcripts and records of students are managed by specialized software. Each lecturer has a small locker to keep documents and materials. Although University Library has a huge collection of books, we still have a small bookshelf with the most commonly used books and magazines. Next to the shared computer are modern photocopiers and multi-function printers which allow us to photocopy, print, scan documents thanks to the high-speed Wi-Fi connection of our university. The oval table is not too big, but enough for our meetings, discussions among lecturers, groups, and student association leaders. For important sessions that require the whole department, we will register main conference rooms equipped with the most modern sound system and projectors. Smaller than the main office, the offices of the Dean and Vice Deans are also where student association leaders can discuss policies and action plans to motivate students. These plans and action results are presented in various formats such as text, pictures, posters, emulation flags or certificates. To maintain a green, safe, clean and beautiful studying environment, the university has signed a long-term contract with a professional cleaning company. Our staff and students also take some practical action such as planting trees, using water and sanitation facilities rationally, decorating, and regularly updating bulletin boards. 
the elevators are more convenient for moving to higher floors or transporting heavy items. However, many lecturers and students like to take the stairs to exercise and improve their health. And now, let's visit the music classroom on the second floor of Block H. And the place we are staying right here is the music room. Uh, here we have access to musical instruments, we learn music as well as practice for performances. It is very interesting here and students just love it. Art education is getting more and more attention in Vietnam. Fine arts and music courses attract more and more students. The music classrooms operate more efficiently. Despite this, the instruments such as organs, piano, guitar, drum are still fine thanks to regular maintenance. We are coming near to the Anatomy, Human and Animal Physiology Lab. Well, this room enables our students to conduct some experiments as part of our study. Go! Knowledge of biology, especially the human body structure, has appeared quite a lot in primary school textbooks. Students can deepen their understanding through experiential learning activities with visual models in the University Laboratory of Human Anatomy and Physiology. Hello everyone, these are the specialized rooms for learning craftsmanship skills. And it includes many subjects like cooking, sewing, and so on. The university offers a variety of courses to help students develop soft skills. For example, many female students often take courses such as confetti making, tailoring, and baking. In addition to the usual teaching facilities, the tailoring classroom also has cutting tables and chairs, measuring tapes, straight rulers, multicolored chalks and threads, fabrics, scissors, tracing papers, sewing machines. After finishing the course with most practice periods, students can make some simple clothes by themselves. In the baking course, students practice making flan, cream and other cakes. 
The baking classroom is full of essential items such as shelves, sinks, basins, cups, bowls, plates, spoons, chopsticks, knives, scissors, ovens, refrigerators. Okay, we are standing in front of the ICD Center's office. Well, this is the place that you can go to if you want to repair your laptop, printer, camera, and so on. Also, you can ask people here to help you um, update and install software. And if you want to register for courses about software as well as hardware, you can also come here. Computer rooms and internet connections are regularly maintained and upgraded. As a result, students can easily use modern teaching software and improve their informatics technology skills and language competencies. The university has developed greenery and self-study zones where students often meet outside of class. Where I'm standing right now is known as the self-study area of Block B. Well, there are several different self-study areas like this all around the campus. Cooperating with domestic and foreign libraries, the university library helps lecturers and students legally access huge sources of printed books, articles, data, or electronic copies on the internet. Although printed books, articles and dissertations are currently full of two floors in the second campus, readers easily search through specialized software and scientific arrangement. This year, the University Library will expand to the new building with new bookstores, tables and chairs, and self-study areas to better meet the research needs of lecturers and students. During peak time, the cellars have no space. A part of the schoolyard becomes a parking lot. Technological devices are used to increase tracking. In every building, water at modern purifiers can be drunk directly. The ground floor of Blocka has many useful offices for students. For example, financial transactions are more convenient with the bank branch on campus. Students can register for insurance and medical services or get drugs at the medical center. Students can find useful courses, books or supports at the Center of Information Technology, the Publishing House or the Center for Student Assistance and Entrepreneurship Development. Along with the grocery store in the lobby of Block A, the canteen on the ground floor of Block B and Block C provide safe and hygienic food. Many people even choose this beautiful and large canteen as the venue for their meeting parties. 
So today we have some questions for your research. Okay. Yeah. Good so pleasure. yeah, let's begin. Uh, so uh, today, how many are there topics? Ah, so you already know today. See that today so depends. Uh, Student research, uh, scientific research of our department, you know. Mm -hmm. We have uh, this year's uh, nine topics. Wow. Yes, That's nine topics. Yeah. So, do the students that uh, defend the topics, they work alone during the process or they co collaborate? Uh, they can choose uh, alone one person per, uh, per subject, or they can uh, create a group. Uh, a group of students consists of five of for students, okay, they can start uh, from very uh, early on times before uh, yes before beginning uh, of school year. Okay. So, one more question. Yeah. Uh, how long does it take since they begin start uh, to doing this research? The time you want to say? Yeah. Duration. Okay. They can choose the topics very early. For example, at the end of summer. Uh, during, during the summers, they can choose the lecturers and choose the topics. Normally, they have to start from September at the beginning of the school years. The students have to sign a contract with the university. You see, we have the Office of uh, Research Activities, and um, they have uh, about, I think, so nine or ten months to finish their task. Oh, so, I think they better start early so they yeah, don't have yeah. to hurry. In general, the Ho Chi Minh City University of Education has constantly improved facilities, the study environment, and the quality of training. In addition to some university facilities presented above, primary education students can go to many primary schools during their study and practicum.